Welcome back in. This segment brought to you by Southeast Termite and Pest Control. Man, I wish they'd taken care of the hotel room I was in in Columbus earlier this week and I wouldn't have had a spider bite. It is spring and that means carpenter bees are drilling and termites are swarming. Protect your home by calling Southeast Termite and Pest Control. That's who I call. They are the best in East Tennessee, I'm telling you. SoutheastTermite.com to learn more. Give them a shout. Uh, most important returnee this fall. I put four up here. All right, four guys didn't take part this spring. This fall, Juwan Jennings, Todd Kelly Jr., Darren Kirkland Jr., Trey Smith. Who's most important for Tennessee to get back for the fall? Darren Kirkland Jr. I struggle with this because I think Trey Smith's the best player. And I agree. But the guy that can make the biggest impact is Kirkland Jr. Okay, let's come back. Because that run defense. Agreed. I think you, you need Kirkland Jr. out there. Daniel, Mike. I think I got to go with Trey Smith just because when you look at the offensive line as a whole, you know, he's really that, that real heart and soul of it. You know, that's got to be your one group that they got to play together more than anybody else. And I think without having him, who your, your, your leader on that is going to be your guy that's the best, but he's going to be able to hold everyone accountable because he's doing it right. If you don't have that one guy that's doing it right to be able to hold everyone accountable, then it's going to be a really rough year for the O-line. Okay. I, I agree, Trey Smith. And I would say Jawan Jennings is maybe the next best football player on there, but I think they've got other wide receivers that can make plays. So I, I'm going to go back to Kirkland's my first runner up. I'll go Kirkland over Smith, but only because something we talked about last week in terms of guys you need to have healthy. Uh, and that is, if, if you have Trey Smith, he's only one guy of five. I understand what you're saying, but Kirkland Jr., mm -hmm. we've seen what happened the last couple of years when he wasn't in there. You saw how that defense looked yesterday without him in there. I just think you don't have, you got five linemen. You've only got, well, four linebackers you're going to have now, but I don't know how many good ones you've got outside of Kirkland. So, um, when we come back, I still want to talk about the NFL draft. Which balls will be drafted? Where will they go? We'll tell you what the NFL scouts are saying. That's next on the Sports Force. Come on back. <laughs> 